A few days back, the high school, the, the highs in Seoul rather, went up to 38 degrees Celsius. There's little relief today. The scorcher continues. According to our Che Xiang, the entire nation is now under a heat wave warning, with one city even hitting the big 4 0. South Korea is sizzling with daytime highs, hitting around 35 degrees Celsius. The whole nation is under heat wave warning, issued when highs top 35 degrees. The high in Yongcheon, a city in Gyeongsangbuk-do province, and Yeoju, a city in Gyeonggi-do province, hit past 40 degrees Celsius. Here in southern Seoul, the heat wave is expected to push the temperature even higher, and the weather agency advises people to refrain from outdoor activities. The road is too hot, and the sun is too strong, so I have to carry this parasol. It's just exhausting. It's humid and the sun is too strong, so I am so anxious about being out. I am wearing sunscreen, but I'm still worried. Health experts say that people should drink lots of water and stay hydrated. The scorching weather has pushed up the demand for electricity. According to the Ministry of Trade, Industry and Energy, the maximum electricity demand reached a record high of 90 million kilowatts at around 5 p.m. on Monday, exceeding the government forecast of 80 million kilowatts. But the government assured people that it has more than 10 million kilowatts of stable electricity reserves. Choi Xiong, Arirang News.